salvage my beliefs, perseverance is your key to impossible. So thank you guys for this cool bit about me video. So I ask for you guys to be here. Today's bit about me videos in relation to this week's mini series of get your job. Basically this week I'm going to be telling you about tips and tricks and how to get your specific job that you want to get with either a certain person or a certain company. So let's get right into it. So today's videos are in specific to doing your research. The tip of the day video is explaining how important that is. The question of the day video is giving you some ideas on how to do that. The bit about me video is now going to explain to you how I do that. Now, first, um, if you didn't see the other two movies or the other two videos, the reason why this is so important to do research beforehand before you go for an opportunity or before you apply or anything like that is because it refines down what you want to do, why you want to do it, how passionate you are about it, and all these other different things. And now that I've told you a little bit about it, you know, about why it's important and why it's a very important thing that you do you research because this will help you out ultimately answering your questions and particularly for your interviews is now let me explain how I've done this so you get a little bit more of an example from a specific person so all right um I've had numerous opportunities, right, in different forms of media, of regular website, and all these different things, right? Somebody would come up to me, and it would be one of two things. And I'm explaining the them coming to me first, just so you guys are well aware. I will explain the second part coming up in a minute. Um, but first, they would come to me and ask me, you know, hi, I've seen your stuff. You know, this looks really cool. Uh, I've seen, you know, different posts and YouTube and all these different things. They've seen something specifically of my content or more of my content to show me that you know they've done a little extra research as well as they know what I stand for and what I plan to do and why I plan to do it and and they want to they want to work with me or do a collaboration or anything like that and I think that's really really cool now to think about it is that someone is coming to me for some specific content I put out there right because social media is the free you know free website realm where you can just go to someone's profile or or a company's profile and take a look at their stuff and get a lot of information that way to you know to approach them about a question and um what they do is a lot of them are like, you know, we can, we can help you, you know, with exposing your art, you know, exposing your, your story and different topics and YouTube videos and all these different things. And this, that's, that's why I want to say to you guys that it's, that research is very powerful because not only, not only do they have research on what I'm doing, but they also are saying, you know, this is what I can provide. This is how I can help you. This is, you know, it's all these different things that are setting people apart from just the ones that say, I just want to work from you. These people are like, nope, I want to go above and beyond what what the call of duty is, so to speak, and I want to help you out more. And that's what makes a difference. Now, flipping it on its head for you guys being the ones going out there and getting the job now, right? You guys have to do what they did. Okay, you have to go and you have to go and search out people's profiles, know what they stand for, know what they're doing, everything like that. That's if you're doing a specific person. If you're doing a company, maybe if you know specifically who you're working for, maybe you can do that same exact thing. But if you're doing a company, maybe you need to go check out their website, check out their info, their about page, what they stand for, the job title, all these different things, because it's going to refine you uh, you know, as to your interview questions and answering the questions that people ask you and all these different things. So what I've done is that when I'm going out and seeking opportunities is I would go, particularly I've been finding this more and more that a lot of people that I'm interested in or want to get connected to have social media pages. So what I'd do is I'd, I'd look on Twitter, I'd look on Facebook, see if they have a YouTube channel, all these different things, get as much info, know, know about them, learn about them, you know, because I, I want to work with them for some particular reason. I obviously want, you know, it's, I'm very I'm, I want to be very uh, connected and knowing who they are because who I work with is also my friends and I want to make sure that they're my friends for the future because, you know, having that collaboration and having that opportunity to work with someone, especially uh, with some of the people that I've worked with, I want to keep that relationship because they're awesome people and they, you know, and creating off of that, they, we all get opportunities from working with each other. So, um, but I first go to their social media pages, then I check out their websites if they have any or if they if they have more than one. I learn about them, then I can, you know, either email them, Facebook them, tweet them, whatever it might be. I, I reach out and I just say hi if you have some time, you know, blah, 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 blah. You know, I start out kind of small, just so you guys are well aware. Start out kind of small when you're meeting someone, you know, just to kind of let them respond the way that they want to. Because if you have if you this giant paragraph, sometimes, you know, it's... It's a little overwhelming for the person who you're reaching out to. So just kind of start out smallish, you know, explain a little bit who you are, and then that's it. Um, and then they respond, and then if it if it turns out that they're interested, great, continue, go on, make your info, send them info, pictures, whatever it might be, links, and um, 
And then let them explore you, let them understand and do the research about you. And then if they like you and then you like them, boom, instant collaboration, work opportunity, whatever it is, that's how you do it. Because that's, you know, that's what I've been doing with people is that I, you know, I reach out, I get my information first and then I send them links and then they're able to look at my stuff. And then if they want to, we collab, we work, we do whatever. And that's how things have been working out for the longest time. So I know this has been a rather long bit about me video, but I know it's been chocked full of a whole bunch of information that is useful for you guys. So I do hope that you guys got something out of this bit about me video as well as the rest of the couple of videos for the next couple of days. So uh, if you did and you got something out of it, I hope you like, favorite, and share it. Subscribe if you're not subscribed. More content to come out. I still want you to miss it. I hope you guys get your future job and opportunities. Um, uh, otherwise, remember that perseverance is your key to the impossible. I will see you guys in tomorrow's videos at 10, 12, 12 and 2 p.m. Minnesota time for more great tips about getting your future job. So thank you guys and see you later.